there on the frontier landed. I said, Ahoy! Aye. This be the proud three-masted sailing ship Columbia. An armed merchant vessel bowed for the Pacific Northwest to Nootka Sound. Then we'll be heading down to the Hawaiian Islands where we'll be stopping off for a few weeks and uh, going have a luau and possibly go to surfing and get a suntan and go you know, hula dancing with the natives and stuff like that. But after two weeks in the Hawaiian Islands, we'll be pushing off for China. We'll swap our sea otter pills and stuff like that we got from the Indians with the natives with the Chinese. Then we'll uh, you know, get some teas and silks and Chinese checkers and, you know, and have a tea party here and there. And so uh, when we return to Boston town in August of 1719, so prepare ye for a long and arduous three-year journey. Watch your steps, lads, you're coming aboard. Watch your steps and help the wee young sailors over the brow. Aye, the brow. Aye, the brow. Aye, brow. <laughs> <coughs> Now it be not for the law aboard the Columbia that there be no eating, no drinking, and especially no smoking aboard the Columbia. For the Columbia is made out of wood, and if you be smoking, we'd be going up like an old Christmas tree. Oh God. So if, you, if we catch you smoking, you best be on fire now. Now it also be not for the law that you do not sit, stand, Roller skate, tap dance, aroma size, or place your wee young sailors on the outside mahogany rail of the ship. For the waters they be cold and deep, and the crew is new and swim gnarly stroke, and if you be falling overboard, I you be staying overboard, be noted the ship's log is lost at sea. So don't sit on the rails, okay? <laughs> Not to Cologne, number 632. There be no playing with that starboard foxhill bow cannon. For it's the only cannon on the ship that actually works, and uh, we wouldn't want you blowing your fingers off, and I had to fill out a lot of paperwork and stuff like that. So don't play with the cannon, young man. Don't play with the cannon, thank you. Now, not to Cologne, number 487.95. Be that there be no gambling on the Columbia, because the Columbia you'll never win anything because the ship's rigged. Lively now, shipmates, lively now, for I feel the tide of dug it, and we be set sail with the tide. And the tide it wait for no man. A nice little young lady from Idaho or Utah, maybe, but never, never a man, no. Maybe a little couple from Anaheim or something like that with 16 kids, but, but never a man, no doubt. So lively now, Hawkeye reports aboard and uh, fetch me some fish heads too. Hi Hawkeye, there you be. What brings you aboard? Your little blue shoes bring you aboard. Aye, nice to have you aboard. Secure that port side railing and give me a sight, uh, sounding on the waters. What the bow light be clear. Sing out now when the bow light be clear. Aye, bow light. Clear, we be set sail now. Hawkeye, finish secure the port side race trail and then secure, scurry, scurry now. Scurry up to that, to that uh, bell housing that you always stand on and give me a sight on the watchers ahead. I a canoe off the starboard side. I, uh, I we can beat it in a ramming speed, what you mean, Hawkeye? Is that what you're saying, ramming speed for the Harbor 2? They'd better hurry up or we're going to get into trouble from the Harbor Master again. Hawkeye, you know, I saw you up late last night in the boom boom room on the Zanzibar bar with all your charts and your compasses and your 64 pack of Crayola crayons and such. A little sharpener back, too, that was kind of clever. You know, and I saw you making us a uh, course here. Uh, which course is that, Hawkeye? Aye, to the pirates of the 
here over here to the Hangar Harbor Race. And if I look at the compass here, that says South Way South West. I see a true course. Pirates of the Caribbean Hangar Right. I go to Mark 5. We set full sail. South Way South West. Okay, now plug your ear, shipmates. Fire two. <laughs> 